rain. Right, we'll try just a gentle start, just to see what happens. Okay, we haven't released yet. Yes, we have. Coming down fast. Whoa. that stayed in one piece after a landing like that. again. Again. What are we doing? Whoa! Uh, I think we broke it. Did we? No, we didn't. Well, I over overcorrected that to make it go right more. Uh, turn left more, clearly overdid it. Well, how did it survive that? It did. <laughs> well, it didn't crash that time. I say I'm quite impressed with that new bungee. You may notice I'm not doing any um, measurements on the pool. I have got a uh, gauge in the bag there. Where are we? 
coming up. Right, that time we went right all the way. Some height. Um, come down. No, we come off. We've done a loop. Uh, well, <laughs> that is my best flight ever with that cardboard glider. Even if it is a bit uh, <laughs> uneven. I'd have classed that as a success. Certainly not neat and tidy. But we got away with it. I don't think I've ever walked this far over here. I hope the hat camera caught some of that. And it landed, and it's still in one piece. <laughs> that makes a change. So, a little summary. I put these bits of balsa underneath with the grain going that way because the wing was slopping around too much on the top because the cardboard was um, giving way. So that's to stiffen it that way. We've got carbon fibre all the way along here on both sides. Uh, we've got fiberglass spar across there. We've got fiberglass spar goes all the way along the bottom. That's just a bit of plywood that happened to have a hook shape on it. That's a bit deep there, which I think is why we're having a bit of trouble releasing. And that's just super glued straight on the bottom of the cardboard, the cardboard there. So it's got no lateral strength. That'll come off if it hits something sideways. But, uh, hey, <laughs> we had a flight, finally. A flight that actually looked like a flight. Even though it did do a cup, what was it? It did a loop, it did a spiral, and in the end, it sort of righted itself and flew for a bit. I expect my wife has had enough by now. I think she's gone to sleep over there. So I might call it a day one reasonable flight. If it flies any better, then clearly it's going to be in those trees. Unless I can get it to circle. But this gives me options. Should be able to launch the little glider with that bungee. Uh, maybe not that lightweight fishing line that I'm using for this, maybe something a little bit stronger. 
but that was good. So I'm happy. Makes a change. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.